Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So today I'm doing a French um, infill using the natural nude from Rare Nails. So I'm just starting off by doing my application at the cuticle first, like to just do that fill. And then what you're going to see me do in like about a second is I'm going to add acrylic to the end of the nail. That is to create a more of a square shape because as you can see like they're all rounded and curved due to like endurance because this is a fill. So I'm just going to add acrylic to the bottom and then shape that out to make it more square. And the good thing about this acrylic is it doesn't dry too quickly so I don't, I have to, like, I don't have to work super fast. So I can just take my time and shape the acrylic to my liking. And I'm using, um, for my brush, I'm using a Glitter Bells 100% Kolinsky brush in a size 14. And this brush, I've had it for about two years now and it works really, really well. I'm outside in an AMG, right outside, TT, two-turn baby girl, you know me, still with the dolls that I grew beside, all the niggas around me, I did it, I gotta watch the time, cause it's flying right by, I'm outside in an AMG, right outside, TT, two-turn baby girl, you know me, Call the shorty off a fan stop. Just the one on the video, it's a clean shot. Way that I've been living off and finishing off. I was trying to make it to the end, you know. Certain things just started getting pissed off. Think we need to have a son of I could be a man, but maybe down the road. Right now, I'd rather see my heart turn to gold. Rather see my heart turn crystal. Inside a crib on my own. Soon as I pick up, I'm about to pop up on your phone. Like, I'm outside in an AMG. Right outside. PT. Two turn, baby girl, you know me. Yeah. Oh my. All the niggas around me. Ride and die. Gotta watch your time, cause it's flying right by. Two turn, baby girl, you know me. Outside and I need to Gotta watch your time, this is flying right by. Two turn, baby girl, you know.
okay now i'm gonna go in with in with my long liner brush from savvy land off of amazon and honestly these brushes are so good because they get me that pristine detailed line and then i'm gonna go in with my smaller brush to fill in the french tip because it's harder to do with like the larger brush the longer brush um so i'm just gonna keep doing that on every single finger and before i do the french tip and everything i always wipe my nails down with acetone and again you see i didn't um as you can see i didn't record me filing the nails down or anything yeah i just yeah it's just yeah i didn't i never really record that part anyway but yeah i always wipe my nails down with acetone because it just helps um with painting whatever nail art you want to do on the nail it just makes it easier and makes it it's like oh god i'm so bad at explaining stuff there's just a smoother surface to draw on whatever you want to do to the nail and like with this french tip i'm not going to make it too thick it's going to be quite like on the thin side and it's so so cute i love it um yeah i'm also going to release another video of a french tip a black french tip actually um sometime during this week as well hopefully i'll be doing some christmas sets because it's christmas season let's just hope people do get christmas sets but it's not looking possible at the moment but yeah i'm just going to continue doing that to all the nails and with my um with my french tip or any time i use gel i always use two coats never one and never three always 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 two no matter what i'm doing actually the only time i'll use one coat is if glitter is going over the nails and it's going to cover the actual color so that's the only time i'd ever use like one coat but other than that i always do two coats of um gel paint i'm outside in it And then after that, I'm just gonna. Oh, sorry, I'm so tired. This is actually 12 flipping o'clock, man. And then after doing all of this, I'm gonna wipe the nails down on the sides to make sure that I still have that square shape. Because sometimes when you don't really wipe the um the gel polish on the sides, it takes away from the square shape. And I like my square shape to be perfect, literally perfect. I don't want no bulges on the sides or anything. Then I'm going to go in with my Miley top coat. I'll buy this from Amazon. It's literally my go-to. I never use any other top coat because I love it. And it's just so good. I love it, honestly. And then I'm going to top coat the nails. And after top coating them, I'm going to wipe down the sides again. Just to make sure I have that clean square look. And then after that, I'm going to set them in the nail. In the, not nail. I'm going to set them in the nail lamp for about 60 seconds until they're dry. And then put my cuticle oil on and there's the final result. Well, the final result's going to show in like about a minute. But still, you get you get what I mean. Anyways, um, like, comment and subscribe, guys. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know what type of videos you want to see. Because I literally have no clue what to post on YouTube. I just post me doing whatever sets I do in it. But yeah, um, bye. Inside a crib on my own. Soon as I pick up, I'm about to pop up on your phone. Like, I'm outside in an AMG. Right outside. PT. Two turn, baby girl, you know me. Yeah. Who am I? All the niggas rhyme me. Ride and die. Gotta watch your time.